Hello viewers. Today in this video, I am going to show you the test for the presence of glucose in urine. We will test the presence of glucose in urine by two tests. One is Fehling test and another is Benedict's test. Then we will have another test for the presence of albumin protein in urine. And for that purpose, we will have this xanthoprotein test. If you like these videos, then please like, share and subscribe this channel. So let us start the experiment. So we have two samples, this sample and this sample. In this sample, we will test the presence of uh, glucose and in this sample, we will test the presence of protein. For the test of glucose, we need failing solution, failing solution, this is A, this is failing solution, B. For another test, we need Benedict's reagent. To test the presence of protein, albumin, we need nitric acid and we also need ammonium hydroxide solution. These are test tubes, split lamp and test tube holder. So let us start the experiment. I am taking the sample. This is the sample. In this sample, I am going to add one minute. I am keeping this sample here. Going to add failing solution A. This bottle is uh, having hard lid. Failing solution A, and then it is failing solution B. Now I am going to heat it. You can see the change in color. The color is changing. You can observe the change in color. It is becoming reddish brown. So this appearance of reddish brown color, it shows the presence of glucose. You can see it. Now, I am going to perform another test, another test tube, same sample. And uh, this is Benedict's reagent. Again, I am going to heat 
the tube. You will observe again the change in color. It will become yellowish brown. You can see the color is changing. It is becoming yellowish brown and this appearance of yellowish brown color it shows the presence of glucose in the sample so these are two tests failing solutions test and benedict's test for the presence of glucose now another sample and in this sample we'll observe the presence of protein take the sample in this sample i am going to add concentrate nitric acid be careful it is a strong acid see white precipitates are formed now I am going to heat it and you will see the change in color you will see the appearance of yellow precipitate the color is changing and it is becoming yellowish you can see the color is becoming somewhat yellowish now in this I will add a few drops of ammonium hydroxide solution. Few drops. You can see the yellowish color is turning little bit uh, orange so it confirms the presence of albumin in that urine sample so in this way we perform two tests test for the presence of glucose these two tests for the presence of glucose and this test for the presence of albumin protein thank you very much